Hello, welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, we are going to learn JavaScript mini project of counter. The preparation of a counter using two buttons with the number of the counter to be, if I press less number, the counter should be low. If I press add number means the counter should be high. How simple it is. We are going to discussing more and more how to integrate this project. The project is ready madely which is built for you. I am going to explain you how the functionality will happen. Anyhow, you will be like a receiving this the content of uh, this projects and the documentations and all via like a sources of uh, this course. All right, let's see how it is. Open a sublime. Now I'm going to adding a project to this. Add folder to project. And go to the project where it is exactly. Yes, it is an desktop counter project. Select folder. Now see here, you will get sublime this project here. Counter project. Open the index.html. Yes. Go to the browser and we'll see the output first, how it is. Then we'll come to back to further explanation. Open in tiny folder, open in browser. It is going to be opened here. I'll make you to suit the for our uh, like a HTML page. It will be looks for us good. Now let's see here. I press the thing. Yes. Wow. We see even a, we see a home page of our mini project. Let's see here. The project is having the objective of the counter. An initial value is zero. Less number, or you can make it as a custom data here to but for the button, and also applied CSS. So it is a coming with the like a beautification of this page. And now, if I press less number, it is like a decreasing the value. Where on every click, it is making more to the dog. See, if I add number, how it is increasing the number. See, likewise, you can prepare. With the adding of the number, I make in a color again, it is a green. And for less number, it is a negative value. It is in a yellow. And where it is in a positive, it is moving to the green. And also, if it is in a neutral, zero, it is in a black. How many activities has been done with this project? Like the functionality, we'll see now how it is. Go to the sublime. Like uh, this within the project, the structure of the project is C. For the CSS, one folder is created to making an external CSS. We see for the image of the background and all, I'm, I'll place in the images folder here. In the JavaScript, well, I applied external JavaScript. I place the code of JavaScript, all the requirements over here. All right. One HTML file see here. And this HTML file, I have a prepared like a, like a, some initiating of the HTML5 document and the scripts, title, the body. The body is having one div tag. These are the functionalities I have used for to presenting a clean data. That's it. And see here the button, like a button contained the flex data I have taken. ID, which is the counter I have taken here for H1 tag. The counter, it is always be text to be displayed like a capitals. And uh, the button one and two. Button for the less number, add number two buttons has taken here. And also see. I have applied for jQuery, jQuery, the min. These are the links you can apply. And the bootstrap bundle for the like a look and feel should be like a good and feel. And app.js when JavaScript is also added here. These all so-called it is external files we are using to calling this project. All right. Now see the functionality and uh, with a more detailed explanation. We'll go to the JavaScript file app.js what it is prepared see the app.js very simple the function it is called like a query selector document dot query selector dot counter btn based on the counter btn what is the counter btn here this one btn counter btn it will be act the class based on the class it is calling for the javascript let count equal to equal to zero and a button for each function for each count and for add event listener click event it is created here 
all right else if if it is a verify the previous button and if it is the next button based on that counter is minus minus and count is plus plus that's it based on this condition you will be gone everything the program is done which will be treated which button is clicked is raised from the browser and the select the counter text it is the by default it is in the counter text and the count what is the count it is here and based on the count it will be added and count if it is in a less than zero it will be yellow we have seen the colors you see here less than zero automatically it will be on yellow and if it is in a like above zero like a zero like a positive number it will be converted into the green as you are wish to change the colors as well you will see and also here the neutral if it is a color it is in black other than the two we have implemented for black see we have seen the previous lecture of if else statements we have applied here such a simple project you can use to these are the things are applied here see the source of javascript it is for this line for the link we have applied for uh, calling for the fonts and look and feel good and uh, this is the link for css that is a style sheet we'll see the style sheets as well see now main.css the main.css main white green the root point the height of the things and the background and the images main bg bcg one image is there this is the image is called from like you see from the main bcg it is called here the container the counter the previous button based on the colors also which is applied from here itself the css will be like a the project once the project is handling it's an out end within the single page how many activities are going on you have to observe the things like this here it is a simple showing that HTML form. This form by applying CSS, the making the beautification. The job of the CSS will do that functionality. And the actions of the performing JavaScript will take in here. And this all will comes to the HTML page itself. How pretty it is. So called it is in a project. Try to implement not only the counter. If you wish to do some other activities, if you wish to implement using this application and the project, We'll share you the code and all with you to practice more and more. Thank you for watching this lecture. Thank you.